come back into alignment simply means bringing the energies of mind, body, and spirit together in one cohesive, integral form. Nothing is separate. Everything is intertwined, continuously intermingling, engaging. We can begin a practice of realignment by ensuring our posture is steady, that our weight is evenly distributed along the base of both feet and that the feet are straight out in front of us. We soften through the knees and anchor the tailbone. We relax through the shoulders and align the crown of our head with Father Sky. We allow everything to soften as though a great internal weight is being released from our very soul. We use the hands to gather and to release. As they pull up through the center of the body, we're consciously dredging any energy that is no longer serving our highest purpose. And we extend through the arms, opening up to release this from our very heart center. And then gather in the energies around us, which are always there to assist with love and kindness. And then we fold over and draw up some energy from our great mother bringing this up through the midline of the body before we open our heart to the sun again. And then gather this up and fill up our own pillar of light with the heavenly star that radiates its warmth and love and care upon our entire world allowing all things, including ourselves, to grow and expand. Generally, the breathing is in as we raise up and out as we fold over or descend. Gently step out to the left. Realign your weight and then raise your palm up to the sky. It's as though someone has you gently but firmly by the wrist and you just allow your body to dangle over. And then as we come back up, we use the thumb as a guide, drawing this energy straight down through the midline of the body. Use your hand to gather up from the other side and raise up again, stretching up tall and expansive and then leaning over again and allowing the other side to just dangle over. And then take this thumb and draw this energy down through the right side of your body. Breathe in, gather up the energy of the earth, our mother who is always supportive, our home, our nourishment, a steady place on which to place our feet. I like to imagine I have roots growing deep and wide out of the base of my feet 
anchoring me to the planet as she releases old stagnant chi from the roots into her core. And as my hands draw up, I draw up fresh, vibrant, healthy energy straight up through my entire being. Draw your hands to center, turn them over and expand through your arms, pulling back gently and then turning them back over like great wings, opening up, capturing the energy around you and then closing again as though you could just swim past all of your limitations. They're all a figment of your mind anyway. You're capable of far more than you could ever imagine. You'll never know unless you're willing to try. This is a great form for tonifying the lungs and heart the sources of our passion and our inspiration. Be willing to draw in, to push yourself a little bit more every day so that you can expand into who you truly are. Turn your hands back to back Allow your knees to soften as you gently pull up through the midline of your body and then turn your hands, palms out. And like a shower, dredge up this old energy that no longer serves you and just release it to the four corners of the cosmos who always knows how to make compost of our waste. As we do this, we clear our pillar of light, our temple door. We release all that no longer serves us, creating space and spaciousness, offering a sense of cleansing and purity to move through the body It's like cleaning out an old cupboard and giving away all that you no longer need so that you have space to fill up again and express yourself as you truly are. We're constantly evolving, shifting and changing, expanding and contracting like the waves behind me, the tide goes in and out, washing away the beach and the rocks and then exposing it again. Same is true for our our lives, nothing ever remains the same. Lift your arms up and expand. Allow your wrists to be soft and your elbows to be heavy as your arms descend. Offer yourself the gift of flight, of lightness, the joy of possibility, like fanning the flames of your heart. Reach up and lift your heel and draw in the energy of the sky. Bring it straight into your heart and then allow it to fall down through your body. Turn and lift up again, drawing in this heavenly essence. Bring it into your heart and feel your heart expand with warmth and dignity, the wisdom of the cosmos is truly yours. 
and then draw this down through the midline of your body, just filling yourself up with this radiance, this light, the gift of love that is always ready, willing, and available. Soft, gentle, yet so very powerful, so full of potential. Back to back with the hands again, making light, gentle fists, and then releasing what old hurts what heartaches what long sufferances can you dredge up are you prepared to let go of so that you can move forward with lightness of step with a heart that's open and trusting with a faith so strong that nothing can shake it. We must release, let go of what was and what has been so that we can move into the very real potential that awaits us. Just gently flicking the fingers and inviting it all to go. Softly, softly, no straining. Crossing the wrists and the forearms and then turning the hands over and floating back down. Clearing the clouds of the heart. Imagine on a bright day how one cloud is sufficient to block out the entire sun. And the same is true for our worries, our cares, past hurts that haunt us. They have the very real potential of darkening the brightness of our future. Be willing to let go and trust that what has been has been and what is to come may be far better than what you have known. Always soft, always gentle, no rushing. Feeling into every movement, every moment, and really being present. Noticing everything. So much going on all the time. To close our practice, we reach up and we gather. We gather up our energy. We call our spirit back from all of the places it's wandered off to. Become entangled, become enmeshed. And we call it back to us so that we have ourselves complete and whole, purified and strong so that we can begin each new day authentic, empowered, who we truly are.
Thank you for joining me for this session. May your heart be at peace and may you feel the richness and wholeness of your empowerment. <laughs>